could see hope on the local level. Garrett couldn't wait to bring this fresh pressed carrot juice to his neighbor John. I'd like to see some scientific proof. Our other neighbor, Bob, the one that milks the goats and was quite skeptical, was really liking what he was hearing, and so was his wife, up until... Okay, so here you want to add three tablespoons of coffee into your uh, boiling water, then you want to let it simmer after for 12 minutes. And I uh, pour it in a quart jar and add water so it um, ends up being a quart. Um, then you connect the tube to your arse, and then you let the coffee drain into your arse. Then uh, you let it sit for 12 minutes, and then you release it into the bathroom toilet. On another level, I think I'll learn more from this journey than my son, and for that, I'll be forever grateful. For each of us eventually, whether we're ready or not, someday it will come to an end. There will be no more sunrises, no minutes, hours, or days. All the things you collected, whether treasured or forgotten, will pass to someone else. Your wealth, fame, and temporal power will shrivel to irrelevance. It will not matter what you owned or owed. Your grudges, resentments, frustrations, and jealousies will finally disappear. So too your hopes, ambitions, plans, and to-do lists will expire. The wins and losses that once seemed so important will fade away. It won't matter where you came from or on what side of the tracks you lived at the end. It won't matter if you're beautiful or brilliant. Even your gender and skin color will be irrelevant. So what will matter? How will the value of your days be measured? What will matter is not what you bought, but what you built. Not what you got, but what you gave. What will matter is not your success, but your significance. What will matter is not what you learned, but what you taught. What will matter is every act of integrity, compassion, courage, or sacrifice that enriched, empowered, or encouraged others to emulate your example. What will matter is not your competence, but your character. What will matter is not how many people you knew, but how many will feel a lasting loss when you're gone. What will matter is not your memories, but the memories that live in those who loved you. A life lived that matters is not of circumstance, but of choice.